What's going on guys? It's your boy Worthy Prince coming at ya with another Lords Mobile video. So today I'm going to be selecting my prizes from Guildfest because it just finished for me. But before we do that, I just want to say a couple of very big thank yous. First of all, I just want to thank you, the subscribers, for subscribing and watching the videos I've been putting up. I've been getting some really good comments and we just went over 100 subscribers, guys, which is absolutely fantastic in the last few weeks of me uploading content to the channel. So really, really stoked about that. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much. And I would also like to say a very big thank you to another YouTuber, Brando Free to Play. I'm sure you've all heard of him, I'm sure you're all subscribed. If you're not subscribed, I am leaving his channel description in the little box below. Make sure you click on the link and go and subscribe to his channel. He actually put a showcase up on his channel yesterday telling everyone to come and have a look at me and check me out as the new and upcoming YouTuber, which I thought was absolutely fantastic. So, you know, he didn't need to do that. He did it for me and it was just really, really nice. So thank you so much, Brando. Anyway, let's get back to what we're here for. Let's have a look at the Guildfest rewards that I got. Actually, before we do that, let's have a look at the rankings. So this current Guildfest, I came third, which I thought was pretty good. 1,030 points, actually beats my last Guildfest. This is only my second Guildfest, by the way, because our kingdom is quite new. It's only about, well, just under two months old. So that's my second Guildfest, 1,030 points. And uh, yeah, the guy that came first in our guild, Braveheart, got 2,169. He actually is crazy. He done two of the quests that gave you over 300 points to do eight hell events in the 12 hours or something. Absolutely crazy. But he done two of those. So that's why he ended up on a really high score. Uh, so none of us had a chance of beating him. But there we go. So that's the uh, rankings there. You can see that we've actually gone up a level as well. Uh, we started on grey at the bottom. And it only gave us access to so many um, so many prizes. And then we went up to green. And then, which was this, this guild fest. And now next time it comes around we're going to be on blue. So hopefully next guild fest we'll get some even better prizes. Okay, so let's have a look at the rankings for our guild. We came first, which was pretty good. Um, the guild below actually shot up in the last few minutes. So we thought... Oh, you know, oh my god, they're gonna take, they're gonna overtake us, but they didn't. So luckily enough, we still came first, which was absolutely fantastic. But well done to PWV, you certainly cave our guild, made our guild first interesting this time round. So let's come back out of there and let's go in and let's see what we've got. As I rub my hands together and get ready for this, it's the best bit about Guildfest. You wait six days doing all these quests, and then it's this little moment when you get to pick all your prizes. Okay, so oh. Right, so what we got here, we've got 100 VIP points times 2, 2 Frostwing chests, and we've got some 20% army boosts. Um, I think I'm probably going to take the chests this time around because I want some hearts. Now, I know it's only 2 chests, the chances of me getting the hearts are very slim, but, you know, we'll, we'll give it a go. Uh, level 2, I think I'm going to go for the maggot chest because I am building a blight ring. Um, only one, but I'm only level 58 at the moment, so, you know... I can't wear it just yet, <laughs> but I am building it and I've got it up to blue. So, you know, I'm going to get the maggot chest so I can try and work on my blight ring. Uh, wall repair. Um, do we don't want that. Army attack boost 20 and 30 minute speed up. So I'm going to take the attack boost on this one. Anti-scout, 60 minutes and we've got another speed up there. 50% wing boots. That's pretty decent. We'll take those. Uh, level 5, we've got 2 8 hour speed ups, uh, 11 3 hour wall speed ups, and that looks like a gathering boost. I don't want that, I've already got like 50 of those. I'm going to take the 8 hour research speed ups. So we've got prison cuffs for upgrading the prison, 5 5,000 energy, that's pretty good, or quest scrolls, 6 of them. I'm going to take the energy, definitely. And then we've got, oh, this is a tough one. We've got six 5,000 energy and two eight-hour research speed-ups. You know what? I'm tempted. I really am tempted to take the energy because we've got a special event coming very soon. And it's going to be another special monster coming, uh, which I will cover in another video. But I'm just, um, I'm, oh, I don't know what to do. Do I take the research or do I take the energy? Well, I've already took some energy, so let's take some more, let's take some more speed-ups. So we've got seven material chests, uh, a relocator, or we've got uh, some probably admin, no, guild scrolls. Uh, I'm going to take the chests. I've got relocators and I've, I'm fine for those at the moment, so we'll take the chests. 
Uh, five Frostwing, uh, festive uh, chests or cuffs. I'm going to take the Frostwing. We've got some chisels. We've got some def cavalry defense, I think that is. Yep, we don't want those. And two 15 hour speed ups. I'm going to take the speed ups. This next one's an absolute no brainer. I'm taking the Brave Hearts because <laughs> uh, I need to level up my heroes. Uh, we've got a research boost of 10%. We've got some guild scrolls and more material chests. Um, I'm going to take the material chests. The only reason I'm taking these material chests is because I'm actually working on getting my flutes up to gold and I only need a couple more bits of material so hopefully I can finish it after I open these. Okay, moving on to the next ones. We've got... Oh, let's get that off. Get off. There we go. I've got some army boosts. 50% army boost, so that's a decent one. But 13 terror chests. Oh... I like the terror stuff. Um, I'm not sure what to do here either. 75% wing boots. Wow. Uh, oh, guys, I wish this was a live stream so you guys could just tell me what to pick. Um, I am going to go with... Do, 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 do. I'm going to go with the chests. Because I'm not doing too much attacking right now. I'm building up. And I'm sure there'll be another guild fest for me to get some really good army boost. So we'll take that for the moment. Uh, chisels, gems, or quest admin scrolls. Uh, I'm going to take the gems. And then we've got level 15. We've got some siege jewels, which I'm not interested in. Some more scrolls and some speed ups. I'm definitely going to take the speed ups. And then we've got a lot of gold. But I've got a lot of gold anyway. Uh, some more of these 75% wing boots or 4 times 20 thousand energy i'm going to take the energy because like i said there is a special event coming this and en this energy is going to come in really handy okay level 17 um we're not got level 17 oh that's the end <laughs> okay so i think i got some pretty good stuff there i got 20 four times 20 thousand energy three 15 hour speed ups three 600 gems 13 terror chests 11 epic material chests um got two brave hearts if I can get this off the screen, it won't go off. 15 hours worth, or two 15 hours worth of research. Five Frostwing chests. Seven more epic material chests. Two eight-hour research. Five 5,000 energy. Another two eight-hours worth of research. Four speedy boots. Uh, this one's 50%. Um, four attack boosts at 20% which is pretty cool compared to the other two in that line. Six maggot chests and two frost wing chests. So overall, not a bad haul to be honest. So what we'll do is we'll collect these now. And there they go, into my bag. Thank you very much. <laughs> anyway, that is basically it for this video. I just wanted to go through and show you my rewards. Um, once again, if you haven't subscribed already, please make sure you do and smash that like button because as I always say, it keeps me motivated to make you more and more videos. Let's see if we can try and get 10 likes on this video. And until the next time, my friends, peace out.